Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope this video finds you well. Today I am back again with my topic of Wazu, and I have a newer scenario, new configuration. As you guys have seen my previous videos, integration with Slack and Virus Total, which are the external APIs supported by the Wazu server. I have guided you guys how you can integrate your Slack and Virus Total with your Wazoo server on premises or the st standalone installation. Today we are going to configure an other integration with the Multiverse. So let's see what is Multiverse is an open source and collaborative platform for indexing and searching indicators of compromise. LOCS. It aggregates information from over a hundred public, private, and community threat intelligence sources. This integration identifies LOCs in Wazoo alerts via Multiverse API. It generates new alerts in this with Multiverse data. The Multiverse data fields are based on the threat taxonomy of the ECS standard Elastic Common Schema. Perform the following steps to set up the integration first of all we have the account for this perform the following step to set up the integration get your api key from the multiverse page so i am going to sign up first for the multiverse and i am going to use to start 30 days trial and I am going to use my email address the name username will be the same we have to click on this register button our multiverse account has been created and we have successfully logged in to our account now what are the steps we have to follow get your api key from the multiverse page so i have to find the api key let's explore a bit that multiverse Okay guys, after the successful sign up of Multiverse, we will receive a confirmation email. We have to click on this activate your account button. The link because I have already confirmed my activation link. That's why it is showing we couldn't validate your email address. We have the valid email address. So I am going to click on my profile and refresh this page to find the api key for the wazoo server integration you have to click on this your username option available if i show you guys how you if i am on the main dashboard i am going to click on my username and this web interface will be available we have to click this generate api key and the api key has been generated we are going to copy this key and note this key as well right then what we have to do next edit this configuration file in the wazoo server and include a configuration block such as 
this following and replace multiverse api key with the multiverse api key the root level filter is optional you can remove it to set another value for the integration so right guys we have to copy this api key from here we simply have to click on this and the api key will be copied what we have to do next we have to edit this configuration file and add this integration tag over here we are going to add our api key at this in this tag so i am going to open my configuration file and i am going to add the tag here let's say i have opened this configuration file and i have added this tag and now i have to copy the api key and add that api key here and now i have to save this configuration file and restart the wazoo manager service of our wazoo server So guys the wazoo manager service has been restarted and we can check the status here the service is active and running let's open up our wazoo dashboard gui and it is currently active and running this is how you simply can integrate multiverse with your wazoo server hope you guys understood this scenario i will create another video to test the use cases please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends colleagues and students until then stay blessed stay tuned thank you for watching goodbye